Welcome to the official Travel Guide channel. We go through everything about travel, leisure, and travel recommendations. This video will show you everything you need to know about Phuket in Thailand and why you should add it to your list of places you would like to visit. Phuket offers everything, romance, natural beauty, excitement, tourist attractions, and some of the best food you've ever tasted. Talk about a paradise beach getaway. Phuket, the largest island in Thailand, is also one of the most popular. This island's fame is due to its abundant sugar white sand, tree-lined beaches, and the unrivaled clear jade waters of the Adamant Sea. If you are wondering what's so special about Phuket, it is because you may find some of Thailand's most exotic beaches in Phuket. There is something for everyone. Patong Beach is your neighborhood hangout if you like the commotion. Alternatively, Surin Beach or any location in the island's north is waiting for you to discover if you prefer solitude. Although you can base yourself in Patong and travel the entire island, you can always return to the island's bustling center at night to experience an authentic combination of Thai and Sino-Portuguese culture. One of the most well-known and picturesque locations in Thailand, if not all of Southeast Asia, is undoubtedly Phuket. It is an island surrounded by stunning scenery, with clear blue waters beneath your feet and sandy beaches on either side. It is also a location where several cultures, particularly Sino-Portuguese or Chinese and Portuguese, have come together over time to provide a distinctively different vibe. However, there is more to the area than just beaches. Examples include the Goon Restaurant, which is stunning classical architecture. With a friendly attitude and renowned Phuket nightlife, you can see why the island is a popular destination for travelers in Thailand. Southern Thailand is where Phuket province is situated. It is located in the Adamant Sea and is Thailand's largest island. Due to the Chinese influence on Phuket, the city has many Chinese temples and restaurants. It is no secret that Thailand is a place of diverse cultures. The fact that each region of the nation has a unique culture that characterizes it may surprise some people. The culture of Phuket, one of the most well-known tourist attractions in Thailand in the entire world, is proof of this. Travel Guide assures you that Phuket welcomes guests with open arms, inviting them to immerse themselves in the nation's warm hospitality, rich heritage, and colorful traditions. These cultures create an attractive ambiance that you have no choice but to fall in love with the people. Phuket's complex performing art tradition is one of the most significant parts of its culture. Their participation in rituals, festivals, prayers, ceremonies, and religious temples is evidence of their great regard for Phuket. For instance, every island contains some form of art, which is an effective spiritual practice. Due to the numerous foreign visitors who come to the island each year, Phuket has a wide selection of cuisines. Thai flavors are still accessible, despite the prevalence of international cuisines, particularly those that emphasize seafood. One can find everything from fancy restaurants to modest street vendors providing delectable meals. The location is a seafood lover's paradise, fried or boiling noodles served with either chicken or pork. Kanam Jin, another noodle dish served for breakfast and topped with fresh vegetables and a hot curry sauce. And Nam Prit Kong are some of the local specialties of Phuket. Smoked shrimp and chili eating with fresh vegetables. Here are the top five foods that Travel Channel recommends you try while visiting Phuket. Tom Yum Gong. Thailand's national cuisine is Tom Yum Gong. A memorable aroma is produced by the liberal use of fragrant herbs like lemongrass, lime leaves, and shallots, while the spicy kick comes from chilies and fish sauce. Jumbo shrimp and mushrooms are also in the soup. As a result, the flavor of Tom Yum Gong is a unique fusion of hot, sour, and spicy. Served with rice, it makes a delicious appetizer or an entire main dish. Pad Thai. The dish Pad Thai is well known worldwide, not just in Thailand. Although there are various versions of this famous noodle dish, tofu, bean sprouts, onion, and finely ground peanuts are frequently included. The customer adds fish sauce, sugar, chili powder, and crushed peanuts to personalize their pad thai dish. Noodle soup. Noodle soup is a popular fast food option in Thailand. It is because of the variations in the components. It might be prepared 10 different ways by 10 different vendors, making it almost deserving of a top 10 list. You can have it with pork, chicken, beef, duck, or other edible meats alongside your noodles that are typically thin but occasionally broad in a broth. 
Sum Tam. The spicy papaya salad known as Sum Tam originated in Northeast Thailand, but it is now almost a national dish elsewhere. The sweet or sour scale may change significantly between restaurants due to minor geographical variations in the ingredients. Depending on how much red chili you want, this meal of shredded green papaya offers a good level of heat. Sticky rice and barbecue chicken are the ideal side dishes for Sum Tam. Stir fried chicken with cashew nuts. You may get Gai Med in many restaurants because Phuket is known for producing some of the best cashew nuts in the world. This stir fried chicken recipe with cashew nuts is fantastic if you have a relatively low spicy tolerance. It includes a few dried chilies, honey, garlic, and sweet soy sauce. When eating it for lunch or dinner, serve steamed rice beside it. Given that everyone enjoys a beach for various reasons, the topic of which Phuket Beach is the most beautiful beach is difficult to answer. Freedom Beach. One of Phuket's most stunning beaches, Freedom Beach, is distinguished by its extraordinarily smooth white sand and crystal clear waters. Even though it's a little slice of heaven, it's surprisingly close to the bustling Patong Beach and is relatively calm. The answer is straightforward. There are only two ways to get there, by boat in the summer or a steep slope from the top of the hill. The walk is worthwhile. Kata Beach. At the Patong, Kata Beach is considered Phuket's most famous beach since it also has a large white sand beach with incredible blue water during the peak season. It is a well-liked option for families. Compared to Patong, Kata is less crowded and has more dining options, shops, and a lively nightlife. Many hotels are available for every price range, although very few are directly on the beach. Patong Beach. The primary beach on Phuket's west coast is Patong. Whether or not to reserve accommodations is a matter of personal preference. It is a city filled with eateries, shops, markets, bars, and go-go clubs, but it's no longer in Thailand. Although it can get crowded in the middle, the beach's northern end is still lovely and relatively calm. There are dozens of hotels to select from, but just a handful of luxurious, and there are only three hotels on the beach. Patong is the place to stay if you're coming to a party. Karam Beach. The second longest and most well-known beach on Phuket are Karam Beach. In peak season, the beach is a stunning expanse of white sand and azure water that is so big it never feels crowded. The Grand Beach Resort is the only one with actual beach access out of all the good hotels along the significant beach road. Numerous eateries, boutiques, a bazaar, a market at the temple, and even good nightlife are all available to you. Nam Harm Beach. Nam Harn is a beautiful, well-regarded beach encircled by rolling hills and tiny islets. In the peak season, the ocean is a vivid blue and the sand is exceptionally soft. It differs from popular tourist destinations on the west coast like Patong and Karan. Since the park surrounding the bay is strangely protected, a lot has stayed the same, although you can see many Thai restaurants and street food beside the royal trees. Despite having a few hotels, Nam Harn still has a good amount of authentic local feel. The beach is in a protected cove with calm waters while fishing and sailing vessels can dock. The travel vlog describes Phuket's nightlife as wild but incredibly diverse. For those who desire it, there's everything from boisterous nightclubs to quiet tiny beer pubs, from dinner shows to enjoyable cocktail at a beach bar. Of course, Patong is without a doubt Phuket's nightlife epicenter. The town starts to come alive every night at 9 o'clock and continues in the early hours. Here are a few things to do after dinner in Phuket. Soy Bangala. Bangala Road offers a staggering range of things to see and do, making it feel like anything is sometimes possible. Hundreds of beer bars, dozens of go-go bars, street performances, vendors, lounge bars, games, live music, and more may be found alongside nightclubs that meet worldwide standards. It's not family friendly, and some parts can look quite shocking. With the correct mindset though, it can be a ton of fun and a fantastic night in Phuket. Phuket Nightclubs. While Batong, Phuket's infamous nightlife district, may not compare well to Ibiza or Bangkok, the vibe is more laid back. Nobody minds what you're wearing or how you dance as long as you're having fun and the fashion police are conspicuously absent. You won't get bored in Batong because some older, more recognizable names have attained international fame. At the same time, the newest clubs have something unique and wonderful to experience constantly. Beach Clubs in Phuket Beach clubs are the newest popular trend in Phuket, and success depends on a simple yet sophisticated formula with the proper combination of components. The Phuket Beach Club formula consists of setting up a chic contemporary restaurant bar made of natural minerals as close to the sea and sand as possible. 
Thailand has the world's best beaches, islands, water sports, and food. Phuket shopping enhances its attractiveness. You can acquire magnificent batiks, exquisite pearls, hand paintings, and antiques during your island vacation. Here are the top and best places to shop in Phuket. Jung Salong Shopping Mall. One of the best shopping centers in Phuket, this one sells everything from A to C and is located directly across from Bangla Road. Although there are more than 200 in the facility, Robertson and Big C are the most well-liked. Clothes, sunglasses, fragrances, purses, and accessories are a few items with high-end names that you can seek to purchase from this place. Phuket Weekend Market. If you want to save money, this area, also known as the Naka Market, is ideal for shopping in Phuket. It has a large selection of used versions of almost every item it sells and is along Chao Phao West Road, close to the Central Festival Mall. You should still come here even if you have no money and don't want to buy anything because this Phuket market is still attractive. Chilva Market This night market is the perfect place to come if you want to see Phuket marketplaces open until late. The Chilva Market is a haven for shopaholics with its bohemian atmosphere, an exceptional selection of clothing, accessories, and everything else. You will know in the moment you enter. In addition to the goods for sale, the vibrant shipping containers utilized as storefronts are a sight to behold. Have you visited Phuket, Thailand? Please feel free to share your experience in the comments section. We hope you enjoyed our video about everything you need to know to make your trip in Phuket, Thailand worthwhile. Make sure to hit the subscribe and ring that notification bell. Please stick with us for more travel guide videos. Travel Guide channel makes your travel easy.